All right. Oh boy. Check, check, check. Testing, testing. It's going to be a pretty big file. All right, looks good. Let's do it. All right, I don't know, I don't know if anybody's going to care to see this at all, but I just got done recording my Voyage of the Dawn Treader trailer analysis and had so much fun doing it. I'm not sure how many of you guys know that I'm a, I'm, a, I'm in college now, majoring in telecommunication. I'm going to be graduating soon. And uh, so I had ac got a, able to get access to this really cool studio. Want to do a little behind the scenes thing here, uh, more for myself, just because I'm interested in this kind of thing. And um, just kind of see how it was all done here. Uh, I got the green screen set up over here. Just give you a wide shot. The camera I was just setting on this tripod right here, so it was right there. And I, obviously, I zoomed it in. Um, that's the monitor there. Let me plug this in actually, so you can see. Yeah, so as you can see, that's I've got that on a the monitor there, so I can so I can kind of see what I'm doing as I'm recording. Let me pull that up. Come on, get out of there. Okay, I'm free. Anyway, so I'm filming over here, and then I stand over here. All these blue things here are my markers, so I know when I'm when I'm off screen, so I can walk back and forth. This is called a Kina Flow. And I've got that shining up on the green screen to make sure that it's as bright as possible so it makes it easy for the computer to figure out what's green and what's not so it can remove that background and, and uh, replace it with something, which I'll do in editing, of course. I can't actually, but then over there you'll see we've got my computer, which um, I've got the, my remote with me. So, so I got the trailer going and I'll stop it from time to time and obviously that, that doesn't actually, in editing I'll have to actually add all the shots, but this is just so, you might notice that during the analysis when I'm supposed to be looking behind me I'm actually looking kind of off to the off to the left side of the screen, that's because I'm actually looking at the laptop the whole time. And so I had that set up. And then of course there's another light right here, that's another Kina Flow, and you notice that um, this one uh, is shooting out kind of bluer kind of light kind of 5600 k kind of light. This is more 3200, so you have two different color temperatures going. Again, that's so that the background is uh, 5600, 56, and then, then I've got the, the light that's on me is 3200, so it makes it a little easier for the computer to kind of separate um, you know, what's what, so it can separate me from the background. And uh, that's pretty much it. This took about an Took about an hour, I'd say, more than that actually, to set up because I'd done a little bit of experimenting before, and uh, what was the heads? Oh, um, I think I'm not sure if I still have it, but I did record a test where basically everything was great. Except initially, I was going to use here some studio lights up here. Initially, let's see if I can turn those on. Yeah, those lights right there that are turning on. I was going to use those initially. And I did it, and uh, I couldn't. I couldn't control the shadows. Was the problem? So I had to get a light that I had more control over. So that's why uh, I got this thing. I, I rented all this equipment from the telecom department at my college. So um, I, I don't know if anyone's going to care to see this. I love this stuff. I'm just going to keep a record of all this. Again, this is about the angle where we had it, and then I just zoomed in like that. You can see it like kind of superimposed everything. So this took this something. Basically, I'm graduating this semester, and I just thought, well, gosh, before I go, I should just try to do something, really take advantage of all this equipment. So, uh, great fun. What is there anything else I can show? This is about what it looks like from my perspective. Again, I got all my markers on here. That means I'm that left one means I'm off screen. This means don't go any further than that, because then I'll be out of focus. This little box here, you don't want to go any further than that, then I'll be out of focus. There's the other side, and I look up, and I can see that screen. There'd be I would be able to see myself, kind of a weatherman kind of thing and on that tripod where the camera would be. So uh, this took over an hour of setup and playing around and trying different things. But uh, I'm really glad I have all, well, I won't have access to most of this equipment you know, next spring, so but now's the time to do it. So I love making videos, love trying cool things like this. This got done recording, so gosh, I hope that chroma key background turns out OK, because I, I don't want to have to reshoot the whole thing. So uh, well, you're seeing this now, so you know how it turned out. So anyway. 
Hope this turns out good. Either way, I've had an absolute blast. I've had an absolute blast doing it.